Let's see if the Austrian Empire return under Karl von Habsburg, who's still alive. Let's start with can't zoom in. There we go. They went to war with um Hungary. A Hungary Hungary. They pushed in through the Alps, I think that's the thing. Uh, fierce resistance. They went down and just cut them off, and there they annexed them. And just annexed the entire country. They sent two ultimatums to Slovakia and the Czech Republic. The Czech Republic did, but not Slovakia. Slovakia. Then <laughs> they sent spies to the King of the Austrian um, the new Austrian Empire but not they don't have their lands again and they just they they just yeah we're going to we're going to do that so they got the new territory got new stuff going in The Italian gave them South Tyrol. So they got South Tyrol again. I'm going to cover up these splotches. That's North Macedonia. They went with... I don't know these little countries, so I gotta say this little territory up here. They went to war with Croatia in that little country on top of. And well. The forces are going down here. If all... So, Austria and Hungary... Aust it's still under absolute monarch. But they have lords. Like, the country leaders are now working as lords. They... As advisors or lords... For the country, because why the Austro Hungarian Empire fell, because they it was under absolute, um, it was just political instability because all the country leaders, well, they don't, they don't non existent. So they, all the country leaders are now serving the monarch. They're serving the monarch. So they took the territory down here. I'm gonna go with the war right now. So here, they got this territory, took that. And they capitulated. And the country leader was now 
now a lord who helps the monarch run the country, help them. If they're corrupt, they're um, unfit to rule, then they're, um, they are now, they don't, no, I'm sorry, my cat's meowing. No, Pepper. Clear that up. So, the lords, they're helping the monarch run the country. Because a emperor, he needs help, in a way, to help the monarch. Romania, they want Transylvania again, but they refuse to live under, to give them that territory. They will never give it back. So they're, they did not want to do this, but they did. Use a different marker. Ah, oh, damn it. Clear that up. So Stupid little marker points. They took this. But they... Aus the Austrian Empire... Went again. And took... Transylvania. I'm gonna make it better. As like a... As like the oval... Because you ever seen an Austria, Hungary, Austria m Empire map? They took the cities in the north. They remained after the surrender terms, and they took northern. They took the territory of. Make it a little bit more. No, it's actually a little bit more bigger than that, so. The Romania was under a puppet state. The monarch was now in power. I'm going to use a, the red color. So now they're in power. Now I got in power. They needed their territory, so they sent an ultimatum. I think Yugoslavia. I don't know if this is Yugo or this is Yugo. I'm going to say this is Yugo. And so they just annexed it. They sent an ultimatum. They took... They gave them this territory.
Montenegro wanted to be under a puppet, so they made a puppet. A puppet. So that was a puppet. Germany seen this. They wanted to make an alliance. Red for um, alliances. Just red, lighter, red color. As alliances. Because this, the monarch is now in power in Germany. In Germany made the central powers and this is now a reformed central powers. It's reformed. They send ultimatum to both of them send ultimatum to restore the monarch. And Italy. So they just did. They did what they are asked. So they're now in the central powers. Uh, well, France and England made the Entente, the double Entente, but France does not, they're not France, Russia does not want to get involved in this, they're doing their own thing, I'm going to use a lighter blue. For the Entente. So they're in the Entente. This is not going to turn into the, a great war again. Germany want Austria, Hungary, um, and Germany did had lands in Poland a very long time ago. Dang it! I just raised like and so they both declare war on. So they both declare war on Poland to get lands again. <laughs> they both pushed in. Austria Hunger just wanted this lands. They just want this territory again. Germany wanted this again. So they just got that territory again.
And then they just decided to give it to him. So they just decided to give it to him. There was a white piece. So the territory. They got a little more territory. Ah, not the marker. This was the territory. They got a little bit more territory than they asked for. Um, Russia gave them, gave Germany back this territory. Memo was returned as well. So the German Empire is returning. This is what, okay. I know it looks ugly, but it's just my drawing. France is now getting scared because they're not the same monarch. And they just gave him Elsa Serang. They literally just did. They just, they just did a whole ceremony and everything. And a whole ceremony. Rush. Um, I'm going to draw it. They joined the Entente. They joined the Entente, but the Russian Empire returned. I already did a video, so they already did. Sorry, Ukraine. They just, just an empire just returned out of nowhere under Maria. There's. A mon there is a woman out there with the royal blood of of the royal family. So they joined the Entente, and it just got Poland back. So all Warsaw. So Poland is completely wiped off the map again for like the third time. So Poland's wiped off the map completely. So Poland doesn't exist. So you might think this is going to be a great war again, but nope. It's just a peaceful, the what it is. Oh, I forgot that they had this territory up here. This... So, back to Austria Hungary. Back to Austria Hungary. Back to the Austria. Aust people wanted Austria Hungary to be back. So, whole ceremony of the dual monarchy has returned back to the Austria Hungary. I think this is Hugo. This is Serbia, Hugo. They just annexed it. <laughs> Italy 
wanted Albania again. So they got Albania again. Uh, this is Macedonia or North Macedonia. This is North Macedonia. Fell under Italian hands. So the central powers are mighty and strong. The central powers are mighty and strong again. With the th the triple entente and the central powers are back. They're back. So here, if Austria-Hungary returned with the with the with the two alliances under Karl von Habsburg, George Friedrich, and Maria so and so, I don't I forgot her name, forgot her last name.